Skip and skip X in bed X share close Tennessee and writers Joe Rex Road and Jason Wolf break down Titans training camp practice Wednesday. George Walker ID slash Tennessee and Carl Klug left of the Tennessee Titans stands with twin brother Kevin in front of the van for Kevin's personal training business. Photo, courtesy of Kevin Klug right parenthesis Carl Klug might be the toughest Titan. He might not be the toughest 29-year-old man with the last name of Klug living in Nashville. If Carl's identical twin, Kevin, was going to engage his brother in a scrap or wrestling match, he'd have to build into a rage first. Kevin always gave up at least 10 pounds to Carl. And at one point in their lives it was about 60. Double quote I had to get angry to have any chance against him. Just like he's got to get angry to compete against guys in the NFL who are 40 pounds heavier than him. Kevin said of Carl, you get angry. Or you get work. Double quote Carl agrees with that outlook, you kind of have to flip a switch to play in this league. He said and that's no surprise considering these are twins who talk about four times a day and are set in the family to have their own language. Grind is an English language word they both use a lot. In the past few months, Kevin has seen his young business, Club Fitness, grow quickly. He'll bring a full size van with a gym in it to you. Also, in the past few months, Carl has obliterated the expectations of doctors and put himself in position to help the Titans' defensive line in the September 10th opener against Oakland. The original timeline after Carl tore his left Achilles tendon in a December 19th win at Kansas City. Had him in street clothes and weeks away from returning at the start of the 2017 season, but the 6 foot 3, 278 pound defensive lineman was out there running at the start of his seventh training camp. A full two months earlier than that was supposed to happen. So add it to the legend of the man who gets an appreciative from fans when he makes a play, and understand that his return to the field this season is more than a nice story. It's crucial for a defensive line and a team that draw from his relentlessness. No.97 defensive end Carl Klug, photo, George Walker ID slash the Tennessee and right parenthesis coach Mike Malarkey said Carl was an animal during his off-season rehabilitation, which included the use of painful blood flow restriction therapy to stimulate the muscles around the tendon. He was a top candidate for toughest guy in a locker room full of tough guys before this injury. But now it's almost silly to consider anyone else. He's certainly the only guy in the room who still uses a flip phone. Double quoted single quote as Klug. Fellow defensive lineman Angelo Blackson said, Klug's Klug. More, Kevin Dog finally healthy. Definitely not done single quote double quote one of the hardest working and toughest guys we have. Titans defensive line coach Nicky Sun said of Carl, who was slowly increasing his reps before a left ankle twist that may keep him out of Saturday's preseason opener at the New York Jets. If you want to go down a dark alley, you want to go down a dark alley with that guy. You look at him over there with his kids and his wife. He's a family guy. But at the end of the day, he really represents what it means to be a Titan. What it means to be a football player. Double quote Carl and his wife, Stacy, had three children ages four and younger. And when he reunites with them for a few minutes after a training camp practice, he's a happy-go-lucky father. His on-field alter ego has far exceeded expectations to provide for them. Even with Carl Reed having an injury that can permanently hinder an athlete's mobility, the Titans signed him to a two-year, $5 million deal in the offseason. Skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans defensive lineman Carl Klug addresses the media after the 34-26 loss to the Colts at Nissan Stadium on Sunday. Katie Myers slashed the Tennessean before the injury cost him the final two games of the 2016 season. Carl had seen action in 94 straight games starting with his rookie season of 2011 after the Titans took him in the fifth round out of Iowa. He has played through nagging injuries, as he did at Iowa herniated disc and torn ligaments in a big toe. To name to that actually got reported. Double quote the dude never complains. Kevin said of his brother, he'll just ride out an injury until he can't walk anymore. Double quote quiet tolerance is a family tradition. When the twins were in middle school in their hometown of Caledonia, Mendot, Kevin suffered from a condition that caused him to throw up after meals and choke on his own saliva at night. He and Carl were the only two who knew about the vomiting for a year and a half, which delayed the eventual diagnosis of achalasia, a condition that restricts the esophagus and surgery to correct it. Titans defensive lineman Carl Klug, 97, listens to instructions during training camp practice at St. Thomas Sports Park Sunday, July 30, 2017 in Nashville, 10. Photo, George Walker ID slash the Tennessee and right parenthesis double quote that was quite an ordeal. And it went way too long. Said their mother. Mary, we kept taking Kevin to the doctor but they treated him for asthma until he told us about the vomiting right parenthesis dot double quote Kevin was about 60 pounds lighter than Carl after his surgery. And he never caught up. Carl got a full ride to Iowa and had to prove himself there as a 207 pound freshman defensive end.
Kevin got a partial scholarship at Minnesota State University. Mankato. And played linebacker. To this day, Carl gives the family toughness not to Kevin, their parents, who grew up on neighboring farms in Caledonia, instilled it. More, brawl breaks out at training camp. Double quote grinding is all we knew, Carl said. And they still work out together with that word as a guide. Though in the past several months Carl has had to stick exclusively with the Titans medical staff. That work has further enhanced the club name in the Titans locker room. But that wasn't the point of it. The Titans need Carl and the energy that has created 20 career sacks and so much disruption beyond that number. His comeback is ahead of schedule but it isn't complete yet. Double quote I single quote heard some people say. Oh. You'll never be the same. Carl said. Well. I don't know. We're still going to find out. You know. Contact Joe Rexroad at Rexroad at Tennessean.com and follow him on Twitter at Joe Rexroad. Titans open practice schedule at Thursday 855 11 Monday 655 855 page. August. 16 9 15 11 30 a.m. with Carolina right parenthesis August. 17 9 15 11 30 a.m. with Carolina right parenthesis skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Titans Malarkey and Mariota vertical line 140 Titans head coach Mike Malarkey and Marcus Mariota get ready for the first preseason game against the Jets. George Walker ID slash Tennessee and one of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Titans training camp day 8 vertical line 356 Tennessee and writers break down Titans training camp day 8 George Walker ID slash USA Today Network Tennessee 2 of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 bloody fight erupts between Titans fans during scrimmage vertical line 125 raw video shows a fight between Titans fans during the team's intra-squad scrimmage at Nissan Stadium Saturday, August 5, 2017. Courtesy of Travon Thacker 3 of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Titans Taylor 1. Jack Conklin start season with new babies vertical line 0 minutes and 50 seconds both Titans offensive tackles. Taylor 1 and Jack Conklin had daughters in the offseason, the two are adjusting to new fatherhood, Autumn Allison slash USA Today Network Tennessee 4 of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Titans Friday night lights practice highlights community at Centennial Vertical Line 125 Centennial High School played host to the Tennessee Titans for its Friday night lights practice during training camp, nearly 7, 000 fans attended the event. Autumn Allison slash USA Today Network Tennessee 5 of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Titans Corey Davis expects to play week 1 vertical line 0 minutes and 58 seconds Titans rookie wide receiver Corey Davis is week to a week with a hamstring injury. 6 of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Taewon Taylor, Eric Decker like a big brother to me vertical line 112 Titans veteran receiver Eric Decker has been tasked with coaching up rookie third round pick Taewon Taylor, Jason Wolf USA Today Network Tennessee 7 of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Marcus Mario dispense Titans post practice with fans vertical line 0 minutes and 36 seconds Tennessee Titans quarterback Marcus Mario signed autographs following the end of practice on Monday. Mario spent an hour and a half signing and meeting every fan in line waiting for his signature. Autumn Allison slash USA Today Network Tennessee 8 of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Chuck T helps Titans fans stay close with brother vertical line 0 minutes and 50 seconds Titans fan Stephen Dalton has a special piece of Titans theme paraphernalia that catches the attention of many. Whoa chip 9 of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Titans fans had high expectations for Mario to Team vertical line 0 minutes and 58 seconds fans gathered for the first practice of Titans training camp were in high spirits as each believed that this year quarterback Marcus Mariota would push the team to the playoffs. Autumn Allison slash USA Today Network Tennessee 10 of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Titans fan leaves wife and newborn baby at home to attend practice vertical line 0 minutes and 41 seconds Bruce Alexander, a longtime Tennessee Titans fan said that attending training camp was so important to him that he waited in line since 5.45 a.m. after leaving his wife and two-week-old baby at home to be one of the first ones in the gates. Autumn Allison slash USA Today Network Tennessee 11 of 13 skip and skip X in bed X share close Titans training camp 2017 Titans renovate facility vertical line 0 minutes and 51 seconds Titans renovate facility with new weight room and trainer's room. 
George Walker ID slash USA Today Network Tennessee 12 of 14 Skip and Skip X Embed X Share Close Titans Training Camp 2017 Titans Training Camp Press Conference Vertical Line 151 The Titans say they understand the expectations of the 2017 football season and plan to work hard to achieve their goals. George Walker ID slash the Tennessee M13 of 13 last video next video Titans Malarkey and Marriott Titans Training Camp Day 8 Bloody Fight Erupts Between Titans Fans During Scrimmage Titans Taylor 1 Jack Conklin start season with Nuba Bias Titans Friday Night Lights Practice Highlights Community at Centennial Titans Corey Davis expects to play Week 1 Taylor Taylor, Eric Decker like a big brother to me Marcus Mario dispense Titans post practice with fans Chut T helps Titans fans stay close with brother Titans fans have high expectations for Mario Team Titans fan leaves wife and newborn baby at home to attend practice Titans renovate facility Titans training camp press conference